So I'm here at the student living. And though I'm not allowed inside the clubhouse here, I am just outside of it. And now, as I was walking by, I noticed that there was an interaction between the front desk people here and their supervisor. And this kind of related back to chapter 11 of the book. See, the producers are kind of like the supervisors over the newscast, right? While the front desk people are kind of like the anchors in the newscast. Now, producers' responsibilities is to one thing, they have to work with the director in production to get the newscast on air. They also have to order graphics, and they have to show great leadership. Now, for the anchor, they're going to be reading off a strip. But on that strip, you'll have a rundown of that consists of many different points. Now, on the rundown, you might see the page number, which helps keep strip in their proper orders. You might see slugs that gives a short description of the story. And you'll probably see shots that lets the producer, the director, and the production crew what shots need to be had at a certain time. Now, you also have teasers in this as well. Now, a tease helps to kind of get the audience to know why they're viewing the story. And in order to write a good tease, you need to let the audience know that, hey, if you stay for the rest of this story, this is going to be for your benefit. We also have to realize that the the uh the newscast is scheduled in blocks and each one of these blocks have a certain time period that we need to fill before we get to our two minute break which is also known as our commercial break the reason why all of this is important is because me and my group our newscast is going to be in a couple of weeks so in order to be successful we need to know all of these terms but that's all for now my name is javaris kendrick and this is eagle news